In an age of mass production, Wayne Tanswell is a breath of fresh air. I couldn't wait to leave school and um, I didn't even want to wait for the bus. So I scarpered through the alleyways down to Melford Road and I was hitchhiking a lift. And this guy came along and he gave me a lift. Um, he said, what are you doing? I said, I've just left school. Have you got a job? No. Um, he said, well, I'm looking for a lad to train as a sign writer. You better come with me. He never looked back. Demand for his traditional handwritten signs has never been stronger. With a deft hand, he makes it look so simple. I have these two strokes again, but a shorter right-hand one. We've got an E. Again, we have a C, if we bring it round there, and add that left hand on there, we've got a C. No job's too big or too small. He now teaches sign writing and he's written three books. My old man, my father, who passed away in 2007, said to me, the more technology moves on, the more you'll become a specialist, stick at it. Um, he said, believe me, boy, it's not about the money all the time, it's about doing something that's gonna keep you interested in life forever. And he was right. Next month, Wayne holds the first solo exhibition of his work in Cambridge. Not bad for a boy who left school with no qualifications. People talk about job satisfaction. It's every day. It's every day, every sign. I can't do anything else, so it's just as well I do love it. Um, you know, I do add banter with my customers, with my spelling, but um, I carry plenty of rag and white spirit. Um, yeah, do I make a mistake? It, it, yes, of course I do, but I can get over that.